Six school-aged boys who have been charged for larceny and break-ins in St. Elizabeth have since been granted bail. This follows their detention after a targeted police raid in the parish in which several television sets were seized. Here again is Nika Lewis. It's not the news many would want to hear, but when six teenage boys found themselves on the wrong side of the law, they quickly caught the attention of the St. Elizabeth police. Police can confirm that six teenage students were taken into custody last evening during a targeted operation. Uh, the ages of the student range from 13 to 16. They were taken in due to an ongoing investigation for housebreaking. Eight televisions were recovered at the premises where the raid was conducted. The investigation is still ongoing. At this time, the students are, are in our custody and the uh, representation has been made at the court to decide whether or not we, we grant them bail or to remand them. The once peaceful parish has seen an increase in criminals due to migration, now trickling down to its youngest and most impressionable. However, Superintendent Minto says the police continue to maintain a close partnership with schools to root out and prevent deviants at the onset. This is an active investigation ongoing. However, we will continue to provide the support to our schools. Um, the Safe School Program is very active in this parish. We have been going through a number of the schools working with the deans of disciplines, the guidance counselors, and even social workers. And th there are a number of incidents that have been taking the national Airways over the last couple of weeks. Uh, we certainly will, from our uh, division, provide our community safety and security officers to deploy them into our schools to assist with the behavioral issues and to support the schools with their own behavioral modification programs. In the latest update, the officer explained the boys have been granted bail and released into their guardian's custody. The boys in question were charged for house breaking and larceny. They were granted bail in the sum of 200 $100,000 each, and they were released in the care of their legal guardians. Stakeholders have in recent months been expressing concern for the criminal and aggressive behaviors adopted by the nation's children since the pandemic. Nika Lewis, CVM News.